What's up friends, welcome back to Jew Tutorial and in today's video I'm going to show you how to download the latest version of Realtek Audio Drive, right? So you want to open up any browser that you may have, Google Chrome, Opera or whichever browser you may have and all you have to do is just simple type in Intel Realtek HD Audio Driver Windows 11, something like that, right? Go ahead and hit enter and you want to access the web page from Intel directly. So here you can see the first option in the list that says Realtek High Definition Audio Driver for Windows 10 and also Windows 11, right? So you want to click on that and it will take you directly to the Intel website where you will find the latest version of Realtek Audio Driver. It says Windows 10, but you can also see here where it says on Windows 11 as well. Here you can go ahead and you can see the latest version. That's the latest version that you can find. And all you have to do is just go ahead and hit the download button here. You can see that it is saying Windows 11, Windows 10, 64 bit. So you can go ahead and you can download this. Now guys, all you have to do is hit the download button here, right? You wanna scroll down, you can read the terms as well, license agreement, and you can just simply accept that. And you can see that it's starting to download automatically. So it depends on your internet connection, how long it will take because the file is over 300 megabytes, right? If your download does not start automatically, just simply click download manually here and it will trigger the download for you now i also want to mention one more thing guys you see that it's a 64 bit here in order to check your computer to ensure that you have a 64 bit computer and that it will work just simply click on the windows icon here on your taskbar and simply type system and you will see system information you just simply need to click on that and it will take you to this page here where you can find system type right and it will show you that you have a 64 bit or 32 bit i um, most likely you'll have 64 bit and it will work for you right so but what otherwise if you don't have a 64 bit you can just simple somehow trigger your downloads by a simple type in the real tech audio and you can simple type 32 bit and you downloads and you can just simple go ahead and search for a 32 bit download as well right but i'm almost sure that regardless it should work for you as well so and if you click here, for example, on this website here, guys, you can see that you can find a Realtek Audio Driver as well. And once the download is complete, you'll find it, whether it's in your download or wherever, you'll have this file here. All you have to do is just simply go ahead and extract the file, right? And once the extraction is completed, all you have to do is just simply run the exe file. Now I'm going to allow it to extract here so that you can see what the file look like. And here you can see that my file is fully extracted. So this is the extracted files, guys. And all you have to do is just simply run the setup file, right? So you have a setup.exe. And if you look very closely, you can see, let me go ahead and make this a bit larger so that you can see the icon here. This is a bit too large. Let's put it medium. But if you look at this, guys, you can see the shield over it. It simply means that you need to run the setup as administrator, right? So you can just simply right click on it and click run as administrator, right? And that will allow you to install the application the right way so that it works properly. Now guys, I really hope that you found this tutorial very helpful. And if you do, go ahead and give this video a like and share your comments below. I'd really appreciate that. And if you've seen the channel for the first time, well, welcome to Drew Tutorial. I'm Anjo, and I really appreciate if you hit the subscribe button below to help grow this community. And also, so that you'll never miss out when I release another helpful tutorial just like this one. Thank you very much and see you next time.